Well, if you don't know what to answer, most probably you want to say no. When someone asks you to do something and you're feeling a little bit off and you're at crossroads, you don't know what to answer, it means that you don't want to do it. And it's time for you to reevaluate the way you react to people or the way you engage with them. It's time to think before you say yes. It's time to be in good terms with what you're deciding to do so that you don't get angry with yourself by doing something that you didn't want to do just for the sake of maintaining peace. And this is called maturity. This is called growth. This is called a change. And everything seems impossible until the time you take the first step and you say, no, I'm not going to do it because it doesn't feel right for me, no matter what you say. I will not do it because I'm not going to give you the 100% of myself and then I will feel angry with me. So it's good when you think that people cannot push you or motivate you to do something you don't agree it's going to be a little bit weird at the beginning. It's going to feel scary. Then it will create a little mess with your connections and yourself within you. But at the end of the day, it will get you to better places and healthier experiences. It will get you back in, in peace because you're not going to be walking around life pretending that you're someone else that you're not. Or that you can be what other people want you to be. It takes time and it doesn't happen by chance. It happens when you start to feel that there is something off here and I'm not in full alignment with what I agree to do. And that's a good thing. It's scary. It's a little bit lonely at, at some periods of your time. But at the end of the day, it makes you who you are. And when you look at people and you say no, they know that you cannot. And when you say yes, they know that you're 100% in and you can deliver more than they expect.